morning guys, how you doing on this fine New Year's Day? Happy New Year. Uh, welcome, I have made my first Spark Gap Tesla coil uh, using the Bug Zapper. Uh, thanks to Shaziz, I saw him do this most recently and to uh, Lead Motor as well. I got a few ideas of you mate, thank you. Um, things I've killed, um, this is the Bug Zapper circuit. Um, I, got, I bought two because uh, I thought I might break one and I did. Um, and it came with this tiny little, uh, I can't remember the number of it, transistor. Uh, anyway, I blew that within a couple of minutes. Um, so I replaced that with a TIP 31C and a uh, bit of focus. Um, and that worked absolutely fine. Um, and then I later on killed it. I'm not sure what I've killed on there. There are very few components. Um, I was using the little reed switches as spark gaps and they worked brilliantly until eventually, obviously, I killed those as well by turning it up too much. Um, so, I have a spark gap now, and so here's the, here's the setup, if I zoom out a bit. So, it's quite a big coil, that's the coil of the Sladini. <laughs> Bloody Sladini. Um, so I've put, so this is the second, uh, the, the backup I bought, um, and it's in there, there's the uh, tip 31C in the back there. Um, other than that, yeah, it's just wired up the same as it was in the bug zapper. Um, however, the uh, spark gap goes out to the bottom of the primary. So there's the spark gap, and then that goes out to the primary, the in on the primary, I, I, that's the way I look at it. And then the out or the return uh, comes back on this black wire. Um, the secondary is grounded with an earth ground. So there's a couple of ground rods outside um, and it's just attached to one of those. Um, and I've got the usual IKEA bowl top load. And let's get on with a little demo. So let's get rid of this top light. And hit the switch and turn it up a tiny little bit and we should get the spark gap going. There's 3.5 volts. Oh, before I break it, Tesla Explorer mate, you are going to be impressed with this, I know. High fours. Oh, it's actually tweaking out the uh, Every now and again it tweaks out the uh, top fluorescent. Right, so uh, let's swap hands and let's crank up a little bit and we'll pull some arcs. So I have added up to 10 volts, so we'll just see spark gap will speed up. My first spark gap, I can't believe it. Okay, let's see if we can get a demo out of this before we kill it. So, what do we get? Some pretty little arcs. Cool, eh? I'm well tough for that. Well pleased. Sorry guys, we got cut off. I did actually run out of space. Um, so yeah, that's the uh, bug zapper circuit. Um, awesome, I had brilliant fun with that and uh, you all have a good day and uh, I'll see you very soon. Cheers guys, take care.